That's the worry is that there are no free lunches in biology. And usually if you fight biology, you There's typically no lose. <laughs> There's always a trade-off. And yeah. some of my friends often like talk to me about like these miracle things or this thing or take modafinil and everything will be fine and da-da-da-da. I go, yeah, but what's the trade-off? And I get most concerned when they say there isn't one. Because yeah. then I go, shit, we don't know it. <laughs> yeah, you've got to be careful because absence of evidence is not evidence of absence. Mm. Be very careful when you're doing that deal with, with your physiology. So to come back to the sort of the three things, the first thing we were mentioning is digital detox. And don't worry about the blue light. Worry about light in general. I'll come on to that because that's the second. But Michael Gradazar, as I was saying, what he found is that the blue light doesn't really disrupt your sleep. It's a combination of first, these devices that we use are attention capture devices. And they are designed to fleece you of your attention economy. And they do it ruthlessly well. They've spent tens of millions of dollars designing these products to do that. So what happens is that these devices become hugely activating. And as a result, they essentially will be a mute button on your sleepiness. 